Hello friends and welcome to the architecture enthusiast and to the Casa del Fascio, a building designed by the Italian architect Giuseppe Terrani in 1932. The building, located in Como, Italy was intended to serve as the headquarters for the local fascist party. The Casa del Fascio is an excellent example of the modernist architecture that was popular during the early 20th century. The exterior of the building is characterized by its simple, geometric shapes and clean lines, which are typical of rationalist architecture. It has a flat roof, which is typical of modernist architecture. The roof is used as a terrace, providing a space for outdoor gatherings and events. The exterior is covered in travertine stone panels, which creates a sense of unity and simplicity. It has a strong sense of symmetry, with identical elements repeated on both sides. The building is characterized by its strong horizontality, with long, flat planes stretching across the facade. The exterior of the building is characterized by its minimalism, with little or no decoration. The building features a large number of windows, which are often arranged in geometric patterns. This provides natural light and creates a sense of transparency and openness. The building is designed on a monumental scale, with a large, imposing presence. It is designed with a strong linear design, with long, straight lines that run horizontally and vertically. The Casa del Fascio is characterized by its massing, with large, solid volumes, broken up by recessed windows and balconies, which provide visual interest and depth. It is designed with a strong emphasis on function, with every element carefully considered to serve a specific purpose. It is characterized by its stripped-down classicism, which draws on classical architecture but eliminates decorative elements. The building is designed around a central axis and makes use of contrast between light and shadow to create visual interest and depth. This is seen in the recessed windows and balconies, which create areas of shadow that contrast with the white facade. The exterior of Casa del Fascio is characterized by its simplicity, transparency, and rationalist approach to design. The use of geometric shapes, horizontality, and transparency create a sense of order and openness, while the limited palette of materials and sculptural elements reinforce the building's sense of monumentality. The emphasis on repetition, central axis, and contrast between light and shadow further reinforce the building's sense of unity and balance. The interior of the Casa del Fascio is as distinctive as its exterior, with a range of features that reflect the building's rationalist aesthetic. Like the exterior, the interior of the Casa del Fascio is highly functional. Each room is designed to serve a specific purpose, with little room for decoration or frivolous elements. The interior of the building is characterized by clean lines and simple forms. There is very little ornamentation or decoration, and the materials used are typically functional rather than decorative. The materials used in the interior of the building are typically simple and functional. Travertine, marble, concrete, stucco, steel, and glass are common, and there is little use of decorative elements such as wood or fabric. The Casa del Fascio has an open-plan layout which was a relatively new concept at the time of its construction. The building features a central courtyard surrounded by a double-height colonnade, which creates a sense of grandeur and reinforces the building's symmetry. The interior of the building is predominantly white, with occasional accents of color provided by curtains, carpets, and furniture. This use of color is restrained and controlled, in keeping with the building's overall aesthetic. One of the most striking features of the interior is the grand staircase which is made of white marble and features clean, angular lines that reflect the building's overall aesthetic. The building features a large number of windows, and skylights, which provide natural light and ventilation. The windows are often arranged in geometric patterns, and they feature simple, functional frames. The building is designed as a unified whole, with every element carefully considered to contribute to the overall aesthetic. This includes not just the architecture and interior design, but also the furniture, 
fittings, and artwork. Overall, the interior of the Casa del Fascio is a striking example of rationalist architecture, with an emphasis on functionality, simplicity, and order. The building's use of geometry, materials, and symmetry creates a sense of unity and balance.